Should you use the Canon 6D in 2020? Find out in this video. What's up guys, it's Hanif here. Before I continue this video, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more content like this. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up and turn on my notifications for more content like this. First introduced in 2013, the Canon 6D is a 20 megapixel semi-pro DSLR camera with a full frame sensor which was later replaced with the 6D Mark II. It has amazing features like built-in Wi-Fi and GPS, long battery life, also works great in low light which makes it a great camera for photography. Canon 6D also has environmental ceilings on its body which makes it a weather resistant camera, providing resistance against water and dust getting into the camera so you can really use it in different conditions and the camera should be okay. If like outdoor photography I want to be able to use the camera in extreme conditions, Canon 6D will serve you well. The Canon 6D has a fixed non-touch screen LCD screen which is a downside considering the fact that most modern cameras are fully articulated touch screens but nothing much should be expected from a camera that was launched in 2013. There is also no built-in flash which is not much of a deal breaker considering an external flash is always a better option and gives better results. to the focus i'm not very impressed with the autofocus system of the canon 6d has 11 focus points but compared to its replacement the canon 6d mark II with 45 focus points the 6d isn't the best when it comes to needing that focus apart from the absence of image stabilization which is more of a disadvantage to me the canon 6d is great for portrait photography but if you are into areas of photography like street photography which mostly requires use of light, light with cameras. I don't recommend the 6D. It's, a, it's quite a heavy camera and only major plus side is you're getting a long lasting battery so you could shoot for the whole day with a full charge battery. <laughs> Now for the video features of the camera. With Canon 6D, you can record your videos at the highest res resolution of 1080p at 30 frames per second. 6D has a built-in stereo microphone and a mono speaker. The 6D also has a port for external microphone so you can record high quality sound with the help of an external microphone. I personally wouldn't recommend this camera if you're really into shooting videos because of the absence of a fully articulated screen, which really comes in handy when shooting videos. Also, the absence of touchscreen which makes it quite a struggle when you're trying to switch focus. So people that are not really used to manual focus could find it quite difficult when it comes to switching focus in videos. <laughs> Now to the pricing of the camera. You can get the Canon 6D body only for around $800 on Amazon. If you want a full frame camera and you don't want to break the market, I recommend getting the 6D. But if you have a few hundred dollars to top up, the 6D Mark II is a much better option. So should you use the 6D in 2020? Personally, if you really want a full frame DSLR with good photo quality, I recommend the 6D. Other than that, there are better cameras you should get at the same price range in 2020 with plenty of features lacking in the 6D. I think a good quality sensor camera with a maybe better video and not necessarily better image quality could um, also serve you well than the 6D. That's it for this video. If you want more camera reviews like this, please make sure to subscribe to my channel. If this video gets 100 likes, I'll do another camera review and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.